Okay, BC, your reaction. So Aaron Broster shared a, an extended four minute clip of his interview with Mike Mazzulli, the head of the Mohegan Commission. And it's not that I don't understand Mazzulli's stance, but this resp response comes off as comical because the snarky way to receive this response, if you're a media member, is if we would all be less critical, which is our job to be critical, and if we would all be nicer, what do we win? What do we receive, Mike? Better judging? It doesn't seem like we are will receive the thing we actually want, which is transparency, communication, and competence. So is he right that we don't go publicizing the names of, of the judges who got it right? Yes. A, that's not our job to. That's yours of the ones you oversee. And B, it's not our fault that that's a thankless job on paper. So is a NFL kicker or punter. We only know their names when they screw up. A baseball umpire. How about the guy that cleans the restroom at your office? No one's leaving out a thank you note for that guy. It's a thankless job where competence and execution is expected in which we only know these per people's names when we have an issue. We didn't define the terms of these jobs. That's not our issue. But our issue at media, with media is asking tough questions and trying to find the basis and the roots of truth that why things are the way they are and can they be uh, 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 changed and improved. I, I, I don't know why the media has suddenly become the protectors and watchdogs of athletes' rights, but if you can't sit there and understand why it's important that, com that officials get things right in combat sports, the pay structures, how much goes to the winner compared to the loser, how much leverage they lose, the damage that they take, only to then lose a fight where it doesn't make sense. And oh, by the way, there's no understanding or explanation why. Your response in 2023 is that the media isn't polite or kind enough.